Hey, welcome back. Uh, yeah, hope you're all going well. Uh, no, we've uh, just had more rain. It seems to be the. Oh, everyone's a bit over it, to be honest. Uh, yeah, just every cloud seems to have a, a shower of rain in it at the moment. So we've just been busy doing a bit of maintenance this morning. Um, headers getting to the pointy end. We just found a couple of extra things that are worn that we um, just had to order a few more parts. Um, but yeah, we were going to do this job this morning, a sheep job this morning, but we've sort of taken the opportunity this afternoon. Um, so yeah, joining next week, put the rams in next week. Um, so at the moment, we've got one mob in here in the containment, so we just need to take a few out, um, just just for the numbers, the mob sizes. Um, but what I'm actually doing is running them all through the race here. Anything, anything with a sort of long toenail, or you know it's a bit bit uh looks a bit sore on the foot or um yeah anything a bit untowards i'm actually actually going to rattle here um and just uh, pulling them out um yeah just uh we're taking them home um young tom's on his way out with the uten trailer but we'll yeah we're just gonna i sort of haven't done many but just gonna run them through and uh just visually inspect their feet uh and yeah so it was going to be a morning job, but it was raining this morning, and yeah, we've got a bit of a window now. Uh, doesn't, fingers crossed, there is the odd spit of rain at the moment, but yeah, fingers crossed we don't get any rain, we'll get this done, and, and uh, yeah, that'll be about the day. Come on, turn around. So windy. It's not the time of day probably to be doing this with sheep. They sort of it's funny they're they're more morning animals. Uh, yeah, afternoon stuff's not ideal, but we're just gonna take it when we can get it at the moment. Uh, dogs are at, super excited, which is which is a bit of a pain too, but anyway, it's better than dogs that don't want to work at all. So. So yeah, just as they walk in, if there's one carrying a foot or um, yeah, limping a bit, just uh, you put a rattle on him. And... Sit down, sit. We have been running these through the footpath pretty consistently, so um, yeah, they're... not that they were super lame, but yeah, it's just um, I don't know. We pulled a few out of the other mobs. We probably pulled. Oh, we might have 30 at home now, so uh, yeah, we'll just try and keep on top of it because um, yeah, sore feet, just the long grass and wet ground all the time, it's, it uh, makes it makes it something that's going to just part and parcel of stock, unfortunately. We've got these shoes sorted up, just trying to push them across this paddock of clover, it's enormous. It's got a... <laughs> I don't know what we're gonna do with it. It's, um, I don't know if we're well and getting a, getting some weather to get it dry is a bit of the trick, but yeah, there's an enormous amount of bulk here. Uh, yeah, you can see where they've sort of been knocking it over. How much is here? This, there's a track over here, so I'll get them over onto the track and we we'll get the dogs are gone. Uh, I'll get them over onto the track and they can run down the track. We're just gonna shift them over onto the other farm, but you can. See the way they're jumping into it is how tall it is. So here come here. We're just um shifting the mob of ewes and got some late lambs the ram got in and did a job on a couple so this bloke doesn't want to walk so I'll just give him a lift. I haven't got to go that far. Up for a bit of a snuggle. Uh yeah, funny sort of a day. Sort of, sun's been shining, it's pretty windy. Uh, uh, yeah, a few showers, but um, yeah, users sort of all sorted up pretty much, uh, ready for the rams to go in next week. And relax.
trying to count a few through the gate. Didn't go all that well to plan, anyway. So we can count them here in the paddock. Rough count, about 79. So that's what we sort of, we wanted about 80. We're just trying to put them up into sort of mobs between 350 and 400 for joining. So just with having, using containment and that sort of stuff, which has been a bit of a, um, bit of a, bit of a shuffle around. So anyway, we we should be pretty close now. Um, yeah, so there we go. Uh, it was a bit, a bit agricultural, but it was easier than running them into the yards and counting a few out. So anyway, we got there. So just uh, run back home after getting those sheep sorted out and no this is a tree it's been a few trees come down just with the wet weather so i am just duck home and grab the, the little tractor we're just going to run around and there's a tree sort of fallen it's, um yeah fallen over and it's actually landed on another tree so um yeah we're just going to get in and give it a helping hand otherwise it's going to end up on the road um at some stage and yeah it's on a bit of a blind corner which is a bit of a sneaky one but yeah neighbour had a big big one come down next door to our neighbours yesterday and blocked the school bus routes and yeah so um, you know we'll duck back around and, and anyway but you probably noticed a bit um, when I'm doing these I've got my airpods in uh, obviously for talking on the phone but a big one for um, for podcasts so yeah I've always sort of if I'm on my own or um, generally you sort of get a bit over listening to music on the radio so uh, if I'm on my own I'll, I'll bang the airpods in and, um, and ch chuck a podcast on so obviously plenty of farming based ones but um, anything sort of uh, off-road um, dirt bike racing as well uh, there's a few good ones of them so but yeah could listen to yeah I could listen to two or three hours of podcasts a day um, depending on what's going on um, yeah, so, but yeah, if you notice, I'll, generally I'm, I'll, I'll be listening to a podcast if I've got my earpods in, and, and then it's, yeah, it's easy to, phone rings, you can answer the phone too, so, uh, yeah, anyway, we'll uh, get around and get this tree shifted, hopefully. Here's the culprit, Let's see if we can, sort of mate's gone, other half of him's gone over, and it's just come down and it's sat on the tree, on the next one beside it, but... We don't uh, try and do something, it'll end up on the road. It's not a very big tree, so it shouldn't take much to shift, but it's uh, pretty wet in the table drain, so we'll try not to get bogged. We'll see how we go. Neighbor had to push over. It's a pretty big tree. It's uh, it's wet feet, half dead, chalo rooted, and uh, yeah, fell over. Come back from uh, shifting the tree. So we're just uh, just got the front ear off the windrow. I'm just gonna chuck it in the shed out of the weather. Um, yeah, just got to sneak through Lake Avon Downs quietly. Uh, yeah, water's still still running out of the banks on the drain, so uh, yeah, we're just just having to deal with it at the moment. Um, so yeah, no, hopefully uh, tomorrow we've just got a bit of oil left to put back in the rotor gearbox on the header. 
um, which whether we'll do it now or we'll do it in the morning, uh, I'll just see, uh, and then we can uh, give it a run. We'll get it out and bring the pickup front out and, uh, as well. Probably need to do the bearings in it, whether we do or not. Bloody water's pretty deep actually. Um, yeah, whether we do the bearings in it or not, I'll just wait and see. See how energetic we're feeling. Um, and then yeah, we'll uh, we'll put the big front on, and I want to pull the adapter out and do the bearings in the adapter. And yeah, just give it a check over, um, change the chain on the um, little feeder drum, whatever they call it, um, in the centre there. And uh, yeah, we're um, we're getting to the point where we can nearly organise for harvest. The boys are. Got the mud guards on the truck today. Um, we're not going to change all of airbags. There's just a couple there that are a bit ratty and a bit perish looking, so we'll do them. Uh, it's hard to talk and reverse at the same time. Um, yeah, so, and yeah, we found while they've been mucking around, doing, putting the airbags on, with they found a couple of air leaks, which is good because we've been losing air somewhere, so um, we can try and um, Try and get them sorted, and uh, yeah, we'll. Uh, uh, it's booked in, booked in Monday week uh, for Roadworthy. Uh, so yeah, hopefully we'll get it into the tyre joint and get a few tyres uh, replaced between now and then, and uh, should be happy days. But uh, anyway, thanks for watching. We'll uh, catch you on the next one.